In my eyes, if I talk about uh, Matt Damon, I think he have one of the most uh, a unique choreograph I have ever seen. I mean, he always choose. Sometimes he chose a very good film, a very unique story, or and other times, sometimes he chose like you know st films that doesn't make any sense, films that actors like him don't choose. It's like sometimes I feel like he is Nicolas Cage, but ten times better. But that's it. I think that's what I think about Matt Damon, and uh, there's no no. Uh, doubt that he is a great actor but his film choices sometimes it varies and then you see him doing a film like um, you know uh, a film where everyone is getting little by uh, to survive and there's no story no continuous story whatsoever and then he makes a film that uh, where he got stuck in Mars and that film uh, he, you see the Im amount of storytelling, the amount of um, intensity, everything was there. So if you compare those two things, do those two films, you s will see the difference uh, between those films and Matt Dim's film choosing or script choosing uh, abilities. So it's a very unique, uh, uh, you know, uh, unique way to make your career. A little uh, interesting I think because I every time when I see a film comes out and Matt Demon's in it I have no idea if this film is going to be good or bad because that's what it is that's what Matt Demon does this film uh, it's, it's named Stillwater and it's about it's a thriller film and we all know how good of a actor Matt Demon is when it comes to thriller uh, he is very famous for his uh, Jason Bourne uh, franchise and knowing that he's actually doing a thriller film this time is actually giving me a little hope because I'm, this is a long long time now that I'm seeing him in a thriller film so I really hope that he actually pulls it up and let's watch the trailer now and we'll talk about it a little bit more after we understand what the story is about but all we know is that this film is the thriller film uh, we have no idea what the story is so let's go guys check this trailer out this is how we react welcome back to my channel i'm trying to get my little girl out of jail that's all i give a damn about The day you left from Marseille, I drove to the airport. I went to the gift shop and I saw this necklace. It was gold. It said still water on it. I thought it'd be a little piece of home to take with me. So the folks are born made to wear the fly. You're in Marseille for vacation? Yeah, this is my daughter. Yep, the father of the girl, the, the American student. Yes, ma'am. Allison came here for college, and that's where she met this girl, Lena. One night she found Lena dead and called the police. All they cared about was Allison sleeping with some Arab girl. I loved her. I know you did. But everybody thinks that I killed her. We have exhausted every possible legal action. Is the lawyer not helping you? I'm oh, doing it myself for now. I could help. What's your name? Maya. Maya. That's nice. And she's very protective with me. You seen that guy before? No one would talk to you, trust me. I'm not from here. It's not safe for you. She's my little girl. It will be a serious mistake to commit a crime to prove your daughter innocent. It will not get her out of jail. And it will send you in. Lord, please keep a watchful eye on Allison. Amen. Police. 
Did you ask her to lie? I'm trying to get my little girl out of jail. That's all I give a damn about. You sound very American right now. Good, I am. Yeah, and you're also a stranger here. What did you do? You just have to trust me. That's a very big thriller. But for some reason, everything is unclear in this trailer. I mean, yeah, they actually show some hints about the film. Uh, his daughter is in, in the prison and he is there for a crime. And I think um, his, uh, the do uh, her father, Matt Demon, is trying to save her from the prison and whatnot. And it's happening in other city other than America, I, and yeah, that's the story. And I don't know what the thriller is about. Yeah, there's some action was going on. He was throwing some punches. He was getting beaten up. That was it. And yeah, there was some thriller m moments was there. And I think you have to watch the film to understand the full thing for uh, the entire thing you, there's no way you can understand this uh, film by watching the trailer or you will never get any kind of idea from this trailer at all if you do good for you I didn't I didn't get it and yeah I think this is going to be a decent film because um, it's a thriller well first second is it's not all about action I think uh, nowadays when you talk about thriller films you have to involve action I think you don't have to involve action in thriller film and you can still pull off a great thriller anyway and America or Hollywood is not doing this anymore and I think they should start this or uh, redo this because it's an amazing thing when you see a thriller film with no action no intensity uh, I'm sorry no intensity not it's a no action and but you are on top of your set you are having goosebumps and those feelings are great action is like sometimes it's shoving you those excitement or those thrilling moments so I really really hope this is not about action thriller I really hope that this is about all the thrilling moments that I like to see in the thriller films and I'm I'm I'm, I'm hopeful for Matt Demon because uh, yeah he is doing uh, he's doing great and his film choice of course is a little different than others I really hope that this is a good one and um, I, I have to watch this film now that still water and, and I need to understand what the story is about and um, I have to understand if it is good or not and I will try to review it when I watch this and uh, well I think that's about it thank you for watching this video I'll be seeing you in the next video as well until then I'll take you leave thank you for staying with me after uh, the Eid Eid Mubarak to everyone and um, after a long long break I think three to four, four days of break and finally here I'll, I'll be uploading videos every day from now on Thank you for this, uh, thank you for staying with me.